everywhere I go, my 2A come. When I'm at church, my 2A come. When I protest, my 2A come. You don't want to test because the 2A dumb. Hello everybody, I'm David and I'm here to talk about Line in the Sand, the new album by Bryson Gray and Tyson James. Now these are two uh, conservative Christian rap artists that I've really gotten into recently and they just released a collaborative album between the two of them called Line in the Sand. Now. I, I think this is cool because these two artists kind of, they definitely have the same ideals, but they have two very different styles. Uh, Brian, Gr Bryson Gray is a, a little more faster rhythmic kind of sound, whereas Tyson James is a, a little bit slower, even kind of uh, conversational almost kind of rapper. And I really like both of these rappers. I like both of their styles, but when they come together, I think it, it makes for some very interesting and fun music to listen to. Uh, lyrically, I think they're great as well. Again, they're, they're conservative Christian rap artists, so if you're not into the whole, you know, conservative Christian area, then you're probably not going to agree with a lot of what these guys have to say. But uh, I, I think a lot of Christian rap music is, and, and I'm not going to say probably Christian music in general, it can be a little weak. You know, especially is in the exposing the darkness kind of territory, and that's what these guys do, I think, really well, is that they they look at the darkness that's in the world, and they point it out, and they say, hey, look at this. Homosexuality is wrong, and abortion is wrong, and they, they point out some of these, uh, some of these things that are, they're kind of tough topics to talk about, but they point them out, and they say, this is wrong, this is, you know, not the way that we're supposed to be living, though, you know, we need to get back to following Christ, which I think is is some really powerful messages throughout this album. This album, it, it dives into a, a lot of kind of hard-hitting topics here, you know, with uh, politics and patriotism, uh, race, Black Lives Matter, uh, the whole cancel culture and homosexuality, all of those things, and it deals with them in a way that you don't often see in rap music, especially, I mean, secular rap music for sure, but even Christian rap music a lot of times. Uh, it's uh, artists like Lecrae, whom I, I really liked uh, way back when, have just gone far too much down like the social social justice warrior -y kind of route and and just some of that kind of stuff where it's just like okay and I'm I'm liking what they're doing less and less now and I'm agreeing with them less and less now to the point where now I'm not really a fan of, of some of these rappers that I, I more was a fan of before. And so now I'm discovering people like Bryson Gray and Tyson James that I am really enjoying with, once again, some really just good, powerful, solid lyrics along with some really fun and just energetic and and very in your face kind of rap music which is the the kind of music that i enjoy so this this album has been in my rotation. This album has been on repeat pretty much since it came out a couple weeks ago. I have really, really been enjoying Line in the Sand. If you're looking for some good Christian rap music, check out Line in the Sand by Bryson Gray and Tyson James. It's good stuff. That's all for this time, guys. Do you want to hear more music type reviews from me? Let me know. Comment below. Uh, hit the, you know, subscribe button and all that stuff that you do on this website. That's all for now. This is David Errington, Helix Reviews Podcast, and uh, Helix Reviews on here. See you around, guys. Bye-bye. All right. Everybody keeps saying Bryson Fall Right. I look at them and laugh because I know that y'all right. They send me death threats, but I know that y'all light. And I'm not a drug addict, but I'm always with the pipe. You say you pro-choice? Okay, that's nice. It's easy to say that when your mother chose life. Y'all bragging about abortions that claim to know Christ. You better repent now. You're going to have to pay the price. Say they love me at first, then they turn into a...